Welcome back to A Coward Plays, uh, The Quarry, Part 2. Let's jump right in. Okay, so, I think this guy's name is Jacob. Let's do... Seize the moment. Look, I'm just saying, I don't know why you didn't make a move on Ryan. You should have seized the moment. <sighs> well, can't seize the moment that never happened. Yeah, well, you can't wait for it to come to you. You gotta make the moment happen yourself. Oh, right. Chase the moment around all summer like a dog with two dicks until it dumps you on the last day of camp. <laughs> okay. Wow. I'm not gonna miss it, Caitlin. <laughs> Caitlin? Is that her name? Okay, so are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> I'm glad they're not starting off with. Uh, okay, so um, trying to pretend they're all friends like they did last time. But if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van, so we'd have to spend another night here. Uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line, or I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? Hmm. It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome that the poking out. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Guess we'll just have to find out. <sighs> oh my god. Okay, so we're not dealing with the best people. Breaking the fuel line sounds worse. I don't know, I don't want to cause a fire, but. you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. I don't know enough about cars. Up here, my dudes. To know how big a thing. What? Oh. Jeez. Boom. Oh. oh. There it is. Oh, Ooh. man. Good sound. Ooh. Freak. Oh. Oh. Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Oh. Freaks. <clears throat> I'm surrounded by freaks. <clears throat> oh, thank God. I'm gonna get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. Ooh. I thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> what? Or, you I know, really messed up our, really my interaction with her. emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped an emergency? <laughs> oh, They're all dicks. Man. Try to keep it friendly. Uh, okay, well, at least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn, now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hookup. Okay, 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 let's all put our little dicks away and get this show on the road, huh? Where's everybody else? She's such why, an improvement on Emily. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any chick he wants. Okay, yeah, keep dreaming, Jr. Hmm. Ooh. Abigail. It's going to take me forever to learn their names. <sighs> okay, so Abigail the artist. They're really strong on the freckle game uh, in this sequel. Well, it's not really a sequel, but you know. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Woo. 
Oh boy. You're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Girl butts. Going strong well, once again. It's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And <laughs> by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Wow. There's... <laughs> this is a really weird setup. <laughs> These guys are resorting to crime really quick. <laughs> Um, I'm resorting to crime really quick. Okay, let's do it. We better not get in trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? He'll just think it was a bear or something. Well, aren't you guys leaving? Have aren't you those bags yours? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. I don't really understand. I never right. went to summer right, camp outside of being a kid. On three. One. Two. Three! Ugh. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. I don't know if that's more ominous than the Are butterfly sure in the corner gonna think thing. It was a bear? Oh my god, relax. It's not like we killed someone. Alright, oh, well, look at those thighs. I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts! Aww. This was little Izzy's. Okay, so they were camp counselors for, like, kids. I wanna play a game! That <laughs> is very creepy. Oh? Interesting. Let's get you back to Izzy. Okay. How do I... Ah, there we go. Evidence. Clues. Paths. Okay. So Abigail or Abby and Emma. Got it. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else important. Ooh, this place be in the news. Interesting. So, okay. Freak show goes up in flames. Um, what are the question marks about? I guess I'll find out. I can't believe I'm actually going to miss all those lumpy, loose springs. <laughs> okay, is that it? All right. Hmm. Let's explore. I am very much enjoying the daytime. I hear this is a much longer game. So I guess it makes sense that it might go in and out of, uh, you know, day and night. Huh. 
nothing here. Boo. Jeez. Lively crow. Interesting. All right, so there's there's nothing. Hey! Oh, there we go. You stop that! <laughs> hmm. Not waking up to Dylan's morning announcements. <laughs> what was? Was there someone in the window? I missed it. Whew. Okay. Anything interesting? And cabins? Okay. Any indication of where I should be going? Closed. Okay, okay, there's a pool. Definitely can't see someone drowning in there at some point during this game. This cabin looks a little different. Maybe it's interactive. Does not look interactive. Okay. There's the pool. So we'll definitely be coming here later. I like that they made it a, a larger world, but these kind of games, it does also feel a little eh when there's not, you know, enough things put in to justify exploring that world. You can't tell what's a time waster versus, uh, you know, necessary to explore. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna I'm just gonna look at the, the signs real quick. And then I'll go talk to her. Oh, good. Ooh. Okay, what's this clue? Probably not something I can really decipher yet. Oh, something interactive there. Ouch. Let's hope Jacob hasn't seen this. Oof. Poor guy. Empty vial? 
Ugh. Ugh, what is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. That's sketchy. Hold on, hold on. Is someone gonna be drugging or poisoning others on the trip? I mean, I guess they're already, like, damaging cars. <laughs> Making people stay trapped in a summer camp for a night, which definitely isn't going to have repercussions, you know? For sure. It is really pretty, though. They did a great job. So who's the Josh of this game? Ready to roll? I probably missed something. I'll probably regret that, but let's do let's it. Do it. <laughs> Finally! Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so... Dramatic. Annoying. <laughs> Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself. But louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. I'm struggling to keep track of who these people are. <gasps> oh, wow! Oh. <gasps> nice steering tech. Jinkies. <laughs> okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there. Something tells me this game doesn't what pass if the Bechtel test. A dud, kinda like you and Jacob. It's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. When you get his handle, hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? <laughs> What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. I'm glad they're friends, or at least, you know, friendly. Oh, hold up! Oh, uh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Well, it's daytime. What's the worst that can happen? <laughs> yes. Sure, what's the victory? Two months. No technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, to be supportive, why not? You know what? I actually believe you. Abby, was that a compliment? Your charm is infectious, what can I say? <laughs> I'd subscribe. Yeah, you hear that? Subscribe, as as please. Home, sub, share, smash that like button. Yes, please okay, do well, that I'm right really now. Oh no, you love me. <laughs> I, I love the built-in advertisement. My favorite spot? The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Mm, it... Looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should we should probably, you know, get back. That's oh, yeah. sketchy. Yeah. Gonna leave it at you. Well no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm -hmm. Can't believe you wouldn't Everyone's check that us. out. Everyone, yeah. Nick. Waiting for you. All everyone. Same. I was so distracted by the smoke I didn't hear quite what they were talking about. Yes, I love 
when the characters just get stalked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so... Oh, fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No! It's okay. I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, ew. <sighs> ew? Why? Oh, I'm slow. I'm slow. Hey, I'm sorry. Where were you guys? Ew is correct. Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up onto the. Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me um, let me get it for you. I can take uh, care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because I mean, it's really not that big. She of can a deal. take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, <laughs> thank you. Cool. What? What? Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I? Thank you. <laughs> That's so weird <laughs> and obvious, <laughs> but cute. I like her. She might be my new favorite. I feel like new Sam is alive, but she's a she's a bit of a brattier version hey, of our has Sam. Seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little knee party? Uh, I was listening. That's cool. Oh. What's it about? I was gonna say, he gay? Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. <laughs> really, so look and smell like a butt. No, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. Th this episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. Oh no. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The, the hag. hag. What's it where now? Or Dr. Hill. What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell me, tell me. Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I need to be prepared. Uh, I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's uh, Quarry. Uh, can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, they're supposedly an old woman. Hmm. Died in a fire a few years back. The carnival fire? She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. No, that's sad. You know, like, reports of whispers or whatever, and, and this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Yeah, but that Some doesn't seem harmful. That if oh, she'll try to alone, turn you into her son. Interesting. She'll try to turn you into her son. Or kill you. Or something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways. Haga Haggett's Quarry. You made that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. So her guidance could come with a price. Cool story, bro. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. <laughs> I mean, not for life. <laughs> you got to be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Uh, yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Is, up to it. Is this our werewolf? Get those butts in gear. Sorry, Mr. H. We're like yeah, shifter or whatever. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Hmm, I can't. Okay. Yo, Mr. H. 
What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. I don't know if this guy is on our side or not yet. Or if he's just going to be like the first one to die. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. I guess this game did just come out like a couple years ago, right? It's totally plausible they now have a so, uh, gay couple. Chris, I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh oh, I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just you know about the whole thing w with the. Interesting. Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. He gonna be talking to the cop or something? Ooh. I don't want to be caught eavesdropping in this case, though. Nah, who cares? I want to know. What? Because kids kids. Don't be so much of those. They're almost out of here, all right? You're cutting it pretty close. We don't want to have. Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's a okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know what? I know it. So I think he is working with the cop. <laughs> no, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna. Take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah. He wants yeah, them out of here of before whatever Adios. happens happens. Why have a summer camp out here at all? In that case. Sorry, I, I wasn't... I wasn't listening. I, I was just, like, waiting. Like, I mean, I heard... Uh, I mean, I, was, I didn't hear what you were... We're saying. cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry I pushed you out like that. I feel bad. I disappointed him. This game is really good at... Making you feel emotions. <laughs> wow. You, uh, you need a hand looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. It was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, this is whether or not I should like leave my sister with my grandparents. Oh, interesting. Have to live on campus, you know. My mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, Ryan. This is a really serious conversation for you to be so distracted. But I guess he really needs to get him out of here. Yeah. Is everything okay? You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. Hmm. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. Hmm. But, do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories. Hmm. I'll be a little apologetic. Sorry, I didn't realize. Seriously, scaring kids like that. Got to understand the repercussions of your actions, Buster. Hmm. It's a big part of being a counselor, a leader. Yeah. Just stick to kumbaya next time, okay? What's do a that? little ghost story. You guys don't do kumbaya anymore? Good grief. I'm outgrowing my own cliches. <laughs> this is kind of a slow-paced game compared to Until Dawn. Although, I just replayed the... Seriously, Chris, what's going on? Jess and Mike going up the trail. I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't really think he's going to tell us anything, so it might be best to be agreeable. I already disappointed him. <laughs> Totally, yeah. Best to get you all out of harm's way. Woods are chock full of live game and local hunters hop to it the second camp's over. It's not safe. Where in the good goddamn are they? Something tells me he's not gonna be happy when the car catches fire. Please say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me. They sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off-season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short-staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. Are those his kids? But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van. Put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left him. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let's skedaddle. So who's Ian? It could be like a code. You know, I've read a lot of books where, you know, I like reading fantasy novels, you know, fairies, Make werewolves, sure all ready to go. different kinds of Make shifters. Sure all ready to go for real this time. And a lot of them are different takes on the werewolf lore. I don't know if this is werewolves. It just wolves in the full moon seem to kind of be the Wait, best bet right now. you get your phone back before the rest of us? I never turned it in. You should have <laughs> turned it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Because it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it. Let's go. What's the problem? Ugh. Dude, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. I think you're dooming yeah, everyone. Dude, it's just like... Put it part. back. All right, let me try. What, dude, I'm telling you, all right? It's busted. Well, maybe you're doing no, it wrong. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough. Enough, both of you. Shit. Come on. All right, Come dude, on. Chill. Chill, Let's go. dude. I'm not sure what he thinks he's doing. Well, I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! This is so irresponsible of the guy, Jacob. Ugh. This is painful. Okay. Okay. Well, uh, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. Okay. Maybe yeah. communicate. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. Okay. Swift change of demeanor. Hey, Brian. Come here for a sec. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. Maybe communicate be better. First thing in the morning. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? He's not communicating well for the stakes that are at hand. Like, this one other teenager or young adult is going to be able to keep all the others in line? That's not how that works. Whatever. He's not going to change his mind. Yeah. Sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. Attaboy. 
Lock the doors. And for God's sake, keep the noise down! I don't like the decisions happening here, but I guess that's how you make a horror game happen, right? If I ever get merch, by the so, way, I've been joking with my friends that I should put that on a sweatshirt. I don't like this. Stay inside, that we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um. Oh, dude. Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside until morning. Yeah. Or. Or we could do something else. Oh, God. I hate these kids, too. But they're just being normal kids in this case, unlike Until Dawn, which was... They were a little, they were a little weird. Uh, but it's just hard when you know they're walking into death. <laughs> Possible death. I'm gonna try my best. Fingers crossed. Okay. I feel like I've got to insist, just do my due diligence, even though it'll probably... No, no, no. Not no, no, charm no. him we towards the others. Really listen to what Chris told us to do. Of course. Uh, who cares what Chris told us to do? He's not our boss anymore. P-A-R-T. Why the fuck not? All right, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. One last epic bonfire blowout for all time. Oh, dude. Fuck yes, I'm in, Nick. You're in. Yeah, I'm in. Dylan's okay. in, obviously. Nick, Dylan, my man. Jacob. Caitlin. I go where my people need me. Yeah, okay. Caitlin. Em, what do you say? Mm. Emily and Abigail. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. I'm not going to remember those for a little while Mr. still. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out, you know? Like, um, like one of Ryan's stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. I don't know. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, dude, he won't even know. I, I promised. I no, 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 dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we get it. You know, you. Uh, I knew it. You don't want to disappoint Daddy. Yeah, I just I did not charm him towards the others, but I had to do my due diligence. I don't know why I thought it mattered. It's a horror game. Of course, they're not going to listen. Whatever, man. It's going to be fine, man. Trust me. It's going to be chill. All right. All right. All right. Hacketeers. Party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you will get some firewood. Uh, Emma and I will go to the stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just, I don't know, figure out how to charge the phones for something. All right, let's do this. Yikes. Big yikes. At least the car didn't catch on fire, which means it's still usable. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. What? I'm sorry. Excuse me? Oh my god. At least it's blood or paint or something. Are they about to hunt the kids? Are they hunting the monster? Is Are these... Yeah. Hunting season for what? Jesus Christ! Oh, this is so freaky.
I was hoping you'd come back to me. I hope... Was I supposed to find a card? Let's see what you found. Empty handed. Damn, I missed a card. You need to look around you, find my cards, and I can help you. Where I'm from, we look out for each other. Find them, please. I wanted to. <laughs> You'd better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. Okay, so no card, Not no totem. A story to tell. Be careful. Look out for yourselves. And look out for my cards. Okay, so they're going to be harder to find than the totems were. Damn. Not a fan. Not a fan. I don't like this. <sighs> I guess I should have done a more thorough check of all the cabins. So here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Will humanity prevail or will we grow ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie? Mm. Are they making a joke about Until Dawn? <laughs> First course. Filet al Jacob. Rich and full body, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Ooh. Wow. Well. What? Looks like you're trying to thread a needle with a packet of loose sausages. Oh my <gasps> god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. I'll let that go. Hi, <laughs> there we go. And Viola. All right. Your hair clip, madam. Yeah, you can keep it. It's not too shabby, huh? Playful. I, like I want people to get sense. along so we can get out alive. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> oh! No, they don't. <gasps> okay. So, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Would they beep, keep beer to kids' beep, camp? Beep, 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 what beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's my beer dar. Helps me dar for beers. Huh. Hmm. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beard art, dude. I guess they're the new Jess and I'm just Mike. Gonna, I'm gonna go over here. Does that mean she's first on the chopping block? Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories. A vault. Hmm. Think it's locked. Don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> Me neither. Oh. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh! Jackpot! Hey, uh. Check out my giant melon. Oh, oh. my god. See? You just cut a hole in it? Mm-hmm. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just, you pour the vodka right in it? Yeah. It's the most fun you could have with a hole in a watermelon. Oh my god. Or, well, second most. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna leave you two alone and go look for some more party supplies. What? <laughs> okay. Uh, where would cards be? Or clues. I'll take clues. Harem, scarum? Hmm. 
Okay. Oh, yeah, it's a much more immersive world. Oh my god, that's a lot of locations. Ugh. Okay, yeah, so they are... If I needed any more reassurance, they were counselors. There we go. Okay. Oh? Oh! Oh wait, no, go back. So these are the updates that can happen, as long as you find other clues. Six years ago... Okay. So where does one... Wow, these are a lot of cages. Where does one find cards? I guess that's kind of the point, right? You look around, but... Okay, this is a giant storage room. Ah. Who buys this crap? Okay. Oh my god. Are they there to warn them it's hunting season? Do they keep like the supernatural or the beast locked up and then make it a competition for people to come kill them? Some like weird alpha male hunting tournament. Oh no! Oh no! Uh uh. Hello, old friends. Oh yeah. Nope. We're about to get enough Maybe scares. Give the guy a break. Yeah. Although he did strand everyone here. God. A giant storage room. Interesting. Okay, it's still daylight. It's fine, it's fine. I don't know if I want the door quite yet. I don't I don't know if there's what to do here. Ah, here's something. Okay. Interesting, I suppose. Not quite what I'm looking for, but maybe that will come up uh, later. Oh, excuse me. You know, just casually wandering inside the cage. Feels like it could be helpful later. Have that unlocked. 
Or the opposite. I could have just screwed everyone. I don't know. Do I get to look around the store or is he going to block my way? Ah, he's going to block my way. Damn it, Jacob. <laughs> really nothing else in here? Oh, it's the same thing from earlier. Okay, maybe that's it. I, Where do I find the cards? Okay, I guess this is supposed to be a shortcut. to warn the kids because I don't think they'd start hunting yet. I wonder where this goes. Locked. Um. Jacob! Come check I'm this out! I'm always a fan of sticking together in these situations. <laughs> <laughs> but he's gonna be an ass about Alrighty it. Alrighty then. Door, buckle up because you are about to meet your maker. Done. <laughs> Whoa. Uh oh. Whoa. Key. Or key. Good golly, Miss Molly. No wonder I kept this place locked up. I think he'll be pissed when we made a stash. Yeah, what? I don't know what it. Are you guys no. expecting continued I mean, employment? It's like, um. <clears throat> human rights or whatever. Sure. Yeah. Like, right. are, this now doesn't make a lot of sense. With. Hold that. The door will latch otherwise. Oh. Hell yeah. In and out. Job done. Boom. I want to look around. Go for it. She's kind of creepy. Although Dylan's actually kind of setting off my something's up vibes. Check oh, this I wonder if that's from. I can't um, move or else the door will latch. I forget like their names. This game's Hannah and supplies. Beth. Oh, okay. Um, there's tents back at the fire pit, so just. Yeah, I think that's uh, redhead. Did a bear do this? Redhead guys. Oh, cool. Girl, what? no. What is it? A gun. Oh, cool. No. And a uh, code. Oh, great. For the safe. Oh, my God. Speaking of horror okay. games. I'm done. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, is that it? Looks like it. Oh. So you're, uh, <laughs> you're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah. Might be for good for survival, even though in real okay. life I wouldn't recommend uh, it. Well, I am going to find something to haul this lot back to camp. Uh, 
Okay. What was that? Check out that safe. Okay, they do walk a little faster if you press that. All right. But you are like getting into actual like illegal territory. Hey, very nice. <laughs> What else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. W oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. No. <laughs> Shoot. If it's anything like the flare gun, and until dawn, it could be defensive, but it could also be disastrous. Ah, oh, God. Well, if it's disastrous, there might be a chance to, like, not set them off or something later. You know, you're right. <sighs> Fireworks. Yeah, 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 hell yeah. Oh, fireworks. God, that's oh, ominous. Um, and might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm happy for I him. I found these, like, torn up bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop. Stop. Stay right there. Uh, <sighs> oh, dude! Peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. Okay. Affectionate. If he's excited, let's go for it. Pops? No! What? I can't believe it. Um, okay. Um, <clears throat> pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. <laughs> pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. What a goof. Pop. Oh my god. They're like the greatest snack of all time. I'm glad he's excited about it. Like he deserves popcorn? a little bit no, of uh, no, 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 last no. happiness. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing, like their own subgenre of food snack. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait, is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like 20 years old, aren't okay. they? Okay, look, they predate expiration dates. Well, you're gonna love them. Mm. Oh right. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure <laughs> or buds? <laughs> no, before that. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh, I see. <sighs> Interesting. Ladies first. Mm -hmm. Yep. Which one? All right. <laughs> 